In the story of Lely and Majnun, Majnun searches for his beloved ceaselessly. Their separation is tearing him apart. He can't bear to be without Lely. His body is weary of his spirit. He can't sleep. He's wasting away. So one sleepless night, Majnun leaves his home to wander around the marketplace when he notices a watchman following after him. He breaks into a run and a chase begins, and now there are more watchmen blocking his way at every turn. Majnun is stuck, and he's convinced that the watchman is his angel of death, or at least someone trying to harm him. He's exhausted, he's falling to pieces, but he comes upon a garden wall, and it being his only path, he decides to scale it, and he throws himself over the wall. He hits the ground, and what does he find in the garden? Lely, his beloved, the object of his desire. Majnun immediately prays and thanks God. He realizes that the watchman guided him directly to Lely. Someone asked me, in what ways have I found strength through the difficulties in my life? And I think my answer is within the story of The Watchmen. If I hadn't experienced this phenomenon for myself, I don't know if I could listen to this story cold and believe it to be true, but I personally can think back on every trial in my life and place it within the narrative of this allegory. Every struggle I've had has guided me to a gift. A gift I wasn't able to see at the time, so like Majnun, I was focused on the pain and the heartache. I think it's one of those things that's a perennial goal, like something I will never achieve but will always strive towards is recognizing a difficulty as a potential watchman while I'm experiencing the difficulty. It's easier said than done. <laughs> but I wonder, if you think back on your life, on the hardest experiences, did they lead you to a gift? If you're willing to share, I would love to hear. Okay, bye. I just came home from dinner with some friends and I heard a story about a family who has really been through it. They've really struggled, especially in the last few years. And it just put things into perspective for me. I have experienced pain and I don't want to negate that. I think I'm allowed to speak on it. I don't have to shy away from it, even though other people have struggled more than I have. But I think it's easy for me to say that all of my struggles have led me to something beautiful when I have suffered as little as I have. I don't wanna be so naive to say that this is a universal truth. I don't know if everybody feels that way. So actually my question is even more sincere now. I really wanna know, does this concept resonate for people or does it not?